A 95-year-old German woman is finally telling her story about her involvement with Adolf Hitler during World War II. She's been silent on the topic for decades. Margot Volk spent two and a half years in her mid-twenties as one of 15 women who tested Hitler's food for poison before he ate it himself. Volk told the Times in her first ever interview, the food was delicious, only the best vegetables, asparagus, bell peppers, everything you can imagine and always with a side of rice or pasta. But this constant fear, we knew all of those poisoning rumors and could never enjoy the food. Every day we feared it was going to be our last meal. Volk was drafted for civilian service for the SS. After a failed assassination attempt on Hitler in 1944, she was forced to live in an abandoned schoolhouse along with other women. It was close to Hitler's wolf's lair, but she never actually saw him. The women were forced to taste the food and then assistants would wait an hour to give any poison time to run its course before serving the food to the dictator. Volk may be the only taste tester to survive the war. When Hitler abandoned the lair after 800 days in November 1944, a senior officer helped her escape back to Berlin by smuggling her on board Josef Goebbels' train. She believes the other tasters were shot by the advancing Russians. Volk tried to bury the memories from her past, but now, at the end of her life, she felt as though she needed to share her story. For Newsy, I'm Lauren Gorris.